So one of the beauty items I wanted to share with you that I have on my lips today is the NYX Lingerie XXL Professional Makeup Liquid Lipstick. And this is in the color Stamina. It's a dark red color. And it glides on very softly. This is how the bristle looks like. Let me see if I can show you like this. And with one application, as you can see, it's very pigmented. I got this at Walmart. And I already shampooed and conditioned my hair in the shower. This is one of the clips I use to keep my hair in place or I use it to decorate. I don't um, detangle my hair in the shower. I've read that it helps to just finger detangle your hair um, to help reduce um, to help reduce uh, hair fallout, hair breakage when your hair is like semi damp. And throughout my hair growth journey, one of the things I've noticed is that my left side of my head has way more hair than my right side. That's so weird. But I mean, at the same time, like, even when it comes to like my face, and I think that's normal for a lot of people, no two shapes are exactly the same. So like, as you can tell, on my right side, my eyebrow is has a higher arch and the one on my left side has like a lower arch. This side is like more plump of my face. And this side, I think, I don't know. So I don't know which side. One side is more plump. I think this is more plump. And this side is more uh, like, has like more structures, like thinner. <sighs> so. That's also how my hair is. One side is fuller and the other side is thinner. So I feel like when I put on hair products, I should put more products on my right side of the hair. But at the same time, I'm like, I don't know if that's good or not. Ugh. Because on this side, there's more hair, so I feel I need to put more products so that way it can have a similar result. Oh, ladies. <laughs> but, okay, I'm almost done finger detangling my hair. I'll try to turn around so you can see how my hair kind of looks in the back. That's another thing I noticed, like, this part right here, I always feel the most tightness on the back of my head. Like, this is always, like, the most tender spot of my hair. And I think also because I wear ponytails sometimes, that that creates some more tightness. And... Like, my hair can get tangled, like, right in the back here, right in the middle. I have not put a relaxer in my hair since February, and we're now, um, it's May 24th, so... It's going to be about 
and she pulled me about three months. Since I have not put a relaxer in my hair, and it's going to be about two months or right about the same, maybe three months since I have not put any hair dye. My hair still looks like that jet black color from the hair dye I used from the Dollar Tree. Okay, and just to show you ladies the shampoo and conditioner that I use from Cake. It's Cake Naturally Luxe Beauty. And it's the Curl Next Door and the Curl Girl. So the Curl Girl Curl Enhancing Shampoo. It's meant to moisture, restoring, frizzifying, and shine boost. And I have here the Curl Next Door, the same. It's a curl enhancing conditioner. And I always love to read the back description as like, I get the product. Um, it says, totally to die for. The perfect blend of curl saving ingredients to cleanse and hydrate for bouncy, shiny, frizz free curls with long lasting moisture infused with light oils and hydrators. This frothy blend helps to naturally enhance each curl, increase shine, and block humidity for a fresh, look, lush look. It's all about you, curl girl. Using the goodness. Pour a dollop into a palm and gently massage your wet scalp, building a slight soft lather. Rinse through to the ends. And it says inside of this shampoo, it has aloe leaf juice, sunflower seed oil, and argan oil, just to name a few of the ingredients. And yes, so this is the conditioner, and this is the shampoo. I use in the shower and now I'm going to use Miss Jessie's super sweet back treatment uh, they recommend for this to be used in the shower and leave it on for 30 minutes and then wash it off but I'm just gonna use it as a hair deep all day hair deep treatment and it says here super sweet bag treatment it has avocado butter uh, it's increased hair growth maximum moisture deep penetrating, stronger strands, major detangling, intense conditioning, curls, coils, transitioning, and chemically treated textures. And let's see what else. It says, want long curly hair? Miss Jessie's Super Sweet Back Treatment is an essential treatment for moisturizing, strengthening, and growing out natural curly, wavy, and transitioning hair. Healthy growth and length is what most curlies want. Miss Jessie's can help you in this process by nourishing your hair. The rich treatment is full of shea butter, avocado butter, centel centella extract, a growth stimulant that promotes long, bountiful curls. Be super sweet to your curls and add Miss Jessie's Super Sweet Back Treatment to your healthy hair regimen. Your natural curly hair will love you for this. And what I like about all of these products is not only is it my favorite shade of pink, bubblegum pink, 
I also love that all of these products smell super sweet. So I just put about this much and I'm going to focus most of this product around the roots to like a quarter length of the top of my hair. And I'm going to try to balance it, the product evenly from the top of my hair. And yes, yeah, so as I'm doing this hair treatment, I'm also just going to continue to share with you ladies a little bit of my hair growth experience and journey. Uh, another thing I noticed about my hair is that I have dryness in the fronts. It's, my hair has always been like this, so it's, it's probably not dry. It's most likely just like very textured in the roots. And then when it grows is when the curls from tight loosens up. As you can see, so I feel I have to put more oils and moisture on the roots of my hair. Okay. And I'm also going to try to part my hair so I can evenly blend the products around. Okay, and what I'm going to do, since I already have ha like three-fourths of my hair tied up, I'm going to just focus on using all of the products in like one-fourth each. So hopefully that makes sense, <laughs> like one-fourth of my hair parted. Okay, uh, so I already used the Super Sweet Bag Treatment. The next I'm going to use is the Cake, the Main Manager. This is a 3-in-1 leave-in conditioner. Now, I can directly spray it onto my hair, but I'm actually just going to spray it onto my palm. Three. So I could try to evenly apply the product to my hair. The next product I'm going to use is the Curl Friend Defining Curl Cream.
After that, I'm going to use the Cake the Gloss Boss Dry Oil Finishing Oil, a dry hair finishing oil. Even though my hair is not dry, it's damp. We're still going to use it. Lastly, I'm going to be applying the Curl Whip Totally to Die For Whipped Curl Mousse. And this comes with a lot of product, 8.4 ounces. And it's been a while since I applied mousse onto my hair. Uh, the last time I can really remember I was wearing mousse in my hair was like when I was either like in sixth or seventh grade. And so, yeah, that was like over 10 years ago. Since then, um, I would just continue to wear it, go, my hair, like if I did wear it in its curly form, I would just apply curl cream instead of mousse. So we're gonna be a little old school and bring back mousse into my curly hair care routine. A little bit goes a long way with this. I remember is make sure to shake like whipped cream. You see, and when you just put a little bit, it then foams up, gives you a lot of product. Wow. <laughs> it's a lot of product. That's good. At least you get your money's worth. I don't even know how to apply mousse. <laughs> I hope I'm doing it right. But yeah. Okay. But I used to have like very defined curls when I was a teenager. And then, throughout the years, my curls are just like, I really, they just, it's just like wavy, thick, medium length, wavy hair. And I want to see those spiral curls again. I noticed that um, the spiral curl effect did show in my hair when I did like my first big chop in 2020. My hair was up to here in its natural length. And the good thing is that, yes, it has grown. I want it length. But with length, it stretched my curls out. So that's usually how my hair is. It's always been like that. Okay, ladies, so you already saw the routine of the products that I use. Now I am going to speed up this process and use those products like for five of the cake hair care products and Miss Jessie included onto the three fourths of my hair. And then at the end, I will show you the finished result.
and that's my finished curly hair attempt wavy curly hair routine using cake naturally luxe beauty hair care products I got this at Walgreens overall what I like about these products is the main color that attracted me which is the bubblegum pink colors I also love that they are of a sweet scent the quality uh, I don't like that the texture of these products tends to feel very sticky especially the shampoo and conditioner I don't really feel I'm getting a um, softening effect I feel like I'm getting a thickening thickening uh, texture when applying the products on my hair I like to feel a nice smooth lather when shampooing and conditioning my hair and I didn't feel I got that from this so out of one to five stars I would give this the whole product line three stars okay I cannot find that many products when going to like regular retailers as I like to do window shopping um, when it comes to like affordable girly aesthetic pink sweet theme products that will cater to me as a consumer I know that there are more products online um, however when it like I said, I like to get my things in person rather than shopping online. So as far as it goes to something you can find that's like a girly, pink, sweet theme aesthetic, currently Cake Products is one of the beauty products available to us here in the U.S. Uh, that has this super girly aesthetic and I feel that if I was to visit some more beauty supply stores or beauty supply stores that cater to black beauty like you know going to the hood <laughs> and where they sell like the hair supply stuff I may be able to find some more better quality products that have also the um, packaging that will attract me and uh, the scent, the fragrance, and the quality that will make me happy with the results. This is how my hair looks while it's damp. I try my best to curl it and scrunch it. Um, I don't expect too much from curly hair care products knowing that I also have straight been straightening my hair and then I wear it natural and I have used some chemicals in it so my hair is not going to be super tight curls as I explained earlier in the video um, but at the end of the day that's not really what I'm measuring when it comes to these products I'm measuring more so the quality of it I was not um, requested to make a product review on this this I purchased these products on my own and this is my honest review and even if I was given a product to do a product review on I will always give my honest review thank you so much for watching my channel my beautiful dolls and princesses and these princesses and muñecas lindas hope you have a fabulous week and continuing to practice self-care uh, self-care routine if you have any tips or any routines that you have been applying comment down below. I would love to see what you ladies are doing in your weekly beauty self-care. And until next time, adios, goodbye, ciao!